A plane crash in northwestern Ontario has killed five people, including two pilots. It happened near Red Lake, Ontario. The Bearskin Air flight took off from Sioux Lookout, about 250 kilometers east of Kenora, and it was approaching the runway at Red Lake Airport when it went down. Global's Loren McNabb is in Red Lake for us tonight. Loren? Donna, I'm standing just meters from where this plane went down and all that really remains is its blackened skeleton in a community in mourning. Almost everyone in this town is somehow connected to this crash that took five lives and remarkably spared two. The plane was traveling from Sioux Lookout and went down just a few kilometers shy of the airport. The two pilots were killed along with three passengers. One was a local lawyer, another worked in the mines and the third was a mother of three. The community is hit hard and, and uh, we're all, we're all trying to deal with it. Amazingly, two Winnipeg passengers on board were able to walk away with minor injuries. In fact, it was a 29-year-old man aboard who called 911 to alert them of the crash. He actually ran back towards the plane to pull a 50-year-old woman out before it was completely consumed by the fire. He was even able to walk himself to the ambulance. They are the only survivors. He said that the aircraft was uh, damaged uh, quite severely and that uh, he exited by opening an overwing exit and getting out. Visibility was said to be decent at the time of the flight, although those on the ground said the weather turned nasty just minutes before the crash. Police have said the plane struck the hydro lines before it went down, but it's not clear if that was part of the cause behind the crash or if that happened as a result of the plane going down. Right now, the Transportation Safety Board is looking at mechanical failure. Donna. Loren McNabb in Red Lake, Ontario. Thanks.